Well, hello everyone. Today I'm behind my desk because I'm going to install this Millennium Desktop Monitor Mount DM1 and it's for mounting studio monitors. So I'm going to unbox this today. I'm going to see what it's like. I'm going to fit it. So I've got a solid Beechwood desk here. I happened to pick this up second hand. I'm looking for a desk for a while. Uh, it's a nice desk, it's solid timber, which will be uh, great for installing this type of thing. So, let's get on to the unboxing. Now, so here we got the two uh, desktop monitor mounts, and they're coming two into nice boxes. DM1. I'm going to uh, open these monitor mounts. I'm going to mount one here and one here. Uh, get them about that height that we have for ear listening level. So let's see what's in the boxes here. Okay, and we've got so that's the actual uh, uh now we've got these two here for clamping to the desk. So solid desk, solid timber desk. It's great for this kind of thing. Okay, that's plastic. I wouldn't worry about that too much, so it's not going to be excessive weight. So we've got an uh, adjustable, adjustable there like that. Okay. All right. And provide a big allen key here. So we're going to need that. Okay. Oh, second piece. Oh, okay. No instructions. So we've got got two nice there uh, foam um, foam bits here to rest your uh, manifold on. Okay, so there's a little dent. Right, now, so, quite simple to fit those, just unscrew these, uh, now it's pretty wide here, so, uh, I'll show you the dimensions of that there, so, so you've got, you've two and a half inches, uh, if you allow for the clamps, so you'd be a little over two inches which is quite wide, so probably if you were using an MDF desk or something and you were afraid that those things would would go through, you could probably put a piece of timber, a piece of hardwood timber on like that and that would stop these from going through and damaging your desk. But uh, seeing as I have solid timber, which is a great idea to have, I'm not going to have any of them problems with this. I'm just going to open one all the way, but see, we get a measurement to see uh, what width you can get through on this. So that's fully extended. I have to take a measurement. So 
two inches. All right, so you can put it on, on a, a desk with timber up to two inches. Okay, that seems to be a uh, cable management hole there. As you can see, don't know how useful that's going to be. Go on the desk like that. Right, I'm going to tighten them up from the bottom, now hand tighten, not to over tighten. Now that's really really solid, yeah I'm very happy with that. So next job, now I'm going to have to fit the, uh, the plate, going to have to fit on here. Well, that's what the Allen key is for. So I presume that these two strips will be like this. Or they could be like that as well. Okay, now well, let me just... Get back in the notch. So now, if we open here, we can... Okay, so they go up that high. Now those things are plastic, so not to over tighten. Yeah, that's, that's very good. So, we can adjust them in here however we want. Now, there is one... Uh, there's one issue I see here now with those and it's protruding it's protruding over the back of the bench by about three and a half inches which means if this desk is going in against the wall I'm going to have to keep about three and a half inches so that's just something to consider depending on what your setup is. I think it's going to be alright for me. So that's the uh, desktop monitor mount, so that's one fitted. As I said, um, I'm doing this project on a budget, so I'm looking for the, 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 the cheapest. I'm trying to keep good quality. So this seems to be good quality. It's got a lot of steel, all this metal. And I'll leave a link on the uh, I'll leave a link on the section below where you can pick these up. I got these for $19.99, which is just 20 euro, which is quite a maiden price. So for two of these, you'll be spending 40 euro and there be a bit of uh, postage and whatever. So i leave a link on where you can get them. Uh, so I bought these myself, I'm not getting paid to uh, do the demonstrations. So I just tell people I like to see what this looks like and what these are like. So I'll set the rest of it up and then we'll have a, a look at the finished uh, product. I have those Edouard monitors. I have those for a long time. I'm sort of used to the sound of them now. Um, they're okay. They're 15 watts aside. And they've got a lot of controls and stuff, and you can also have them linked to your TV, and they're good for uh, listening to uh, music. So I wouldn't rely on them fully for if you're um, doing a full mix. I would use uh, maybe headphones as well in conjunction with them. So you've got a lot of connections on them and stuff. So I'm going to be using those here, so those will go up on the stand, I hope. Tighten that. I've got to tighten that. So it's nice timber and all that, and uh, it matches the uh, 
It matches the timber on my purpose. The beach just matches my table perfect. So I like that. It's very nice. I like the black and the old old monitor that I have them for a long, long time. Um, they've been very good to me actually now. So use what you have. So this is what I have. So the second one. Yep. Down in a bit. So I'll be wiring these monitors in and I'll be running the wire down and uh, behind. So I've got loads of room there now. And uh, then I'll be doing some uh, cable management underneath the desk. So I've got loads of room now on my desk. So everything is off the desk. So I like it very much. Nice. So that's my setup.